This video shows a four-point bending test on a timber beam with the grain running perpendicular to the beam axis. The beam is made of glue lamp GL28. The loading diagram shows the simply supported beam subjected to four-point bending. Under this loading arrangement, the bending moment in the central part of the beam is constant. A pair of equal vertical loads is now starting to be applied to the central part of the specimen and we see it bending under the load. The very limited resistance of wood perpendicular to the grain is quickly reached and sudden splitting occurs. Now let's slow that down and look more closely at the point of failure. The failure is so sudden that splitting between wood fibers happens in one five hundredth of a second. We can see the straight separation between wood fibers along the grain. The force displacement graph is roughly straight, which corresponds to the elastic brittle response of the beam. The point of failure is sudden at a load of nearly one kilonewton. This failure load is a tiny fraction of the load that we would see for a beam in which the grain runs parallel to the beam axis. It is good design practice to avoid stressing wood in tension perpendicular to the grain. However, in some circumstances that's unavoidable. 